We've been working with farmers in the Fens to look at alternative land uses for the drained peat soil. And these include uh, re-wetting the peat and looking at alternative crops that you can grow on, on re-wetted peat. This includes uh, novel crops such as rice, which we're sourcing from as far afield as the Philippines and Southeast Asia, but also much closer to home. Uh, so we've got rice varieties from Italy that we're, we're testing as well. We're also growing some of the more conventional salad crops that are grown in the Fens, but with higher water tables to reduce emissions. We're looking at setting aside land for nature and re in the re-wetted peat, so we're creating wet woodland habitat and native fen vegetation. And we're also looking at potential to uh, produce bioenergy, so we're planting willow trees that can be burnt in power stations. Uh, my name is Nadine. I work for UKCH Wallingford and I'm working in the biodiversity group. So we had the idea, so we have a big paludiculture trial field, which is re-wetted peat. And we had the idea we could try rice growing because nobody has done it in the UK before. I found researchers in Switzerland who already do it commercially, the rice growing. And they gave me contact details for um, the US Department of Agriculture, the Rice Research Center. A man there, he selected um, nine different coltardy varieties for me. And so the rice was sent to me. And then I tried just germination and see, getting, getting a feeling for how it actually grows, because I've never grown rice before. And this year is the actual year where we plant the rice out. Also, we arrived here this morning in Pymore, it's in Cambridgeshire, in the east of the UK. And it's our experimental field. It's a peat re-wetting site where we um, re-wetted the farmland. And we have dug um, paddy fields out, which are, have, a, have a, a bank and a bottom, which is filled with water, where the rice is planted into, to keep the rice nice and warm, because the shallow water level in there will keep the temperature up in the night. So the rice doesn't cool down too much and it keeps the weeds away. And we planted uh, five varieties today, and there will be four more. And we might get a heat wave, which the rice will laugh. And maybe not as humans, but the rice will be happy. 